Now, have you been experiencing hip or groin pain when you're walking? Have you been diagnosed with osteoarthritis of the hip or FAI? My name's Nicole Hamilton, I'm a physiotherapist. I'd like to share with you now just a couple of tips that might help you manage your hip pain when you're walking. Of course, it's very important to manage your hip pain with a good strengthening program to make sure your hips are strong enough. That's the first key step. But the other thing that can sometimes happen is you have, if you have very tight feet, tight calves or even very rigid footwear that it actually places more pressure through the hip joint during your walking cycle. So to try and resolve this if you can the first thing you can do is grab a tennis ball or a spiky ball give yourself a little massage underneath your feet which can help mobilize the foot joints and make your feet a little bit more flexible. Your feet do need to have some capacity to shock absorb nicely when you walk a bit like the shock, shock absorbers of a car they need to have some flexibility. If you don't have flexibility in your feet, it can certainly add more pressure up into the hips. So try a little spiky ball massage through your feet. That's the first thing. The next thing is just a really simple calf stretch. So if you get a roll towel and place it on the floor, put your foot halfway up and then simply step the other leg forward and you'll get a nice stretch into the back of your calf. If you try that before you go out for a walk and when you get back, it can start to improve your calf mobility, which will hopefully help your shock absorption capacity through your feet. The last key tip with that, of course, is to make sure you've got the right footwear. So avoid really rigid shoes or thongs. They're not great to walk in. They can certainly add to more pressure in the hip.